As monkeypox cases continue to grow here at home, some high-risk groups are growing more concerned about how those vaccines are distributed. Prince George's County Bureau Chief Tracy Wilkins spoke with one county resident who says the process needs to catch up to the need. When did this get on your radar? Probably back in May when I think it got on everyone else's radar. This man who did not want to be identified says that as a member of the LGBTQ plus community and considered high risk for monkeypox, he's been on a quest to protect himself. But he says it has not been easy to do that as a Prince George's County resident. There is no registration process. They send out a link the day of and you sign up for an appointment, but there's no pre-registration. There's no plan. There's no timeline. A spokesperson with the Prince George's County Health Department tells me that in July, they only received enough vaccines to fully vaccinate 100 people. As we're able to see D.C., you know, vaccinating their population, um, the question became, why aren't we doing that here in Maryland? The Prince George's County Health Department released a statement to News 4 today that says in part, the District of Columbia Health Department is considered its own health department and therefore receives its supply directly from the federal government. D.C. was allocated a much higher number of doses because it has the highest number of cases per capita in the United States. The statement went on to say that the county is now expanding its monkeypox vaccine eligibility and offering more appointments and pre registration Registration. To date, three days worth of appointments were posted on its Department of Health website. This man was able to get one after weeks of trying, a process he vows to share with others. Essentially for the LGBTQ community, we have put together our own information and centralized it. So every single day we're putting up information about where you can find vaccines in different states, what the different eligibility requirements are. As the nation braces for yet another health emergency, Tracy Wilkins, News 4. Maryland Governor Larry Hogan released a statement today that said the federal government has a limited supply of vaccine and the state is now pressing for more doses. He says Maryland has an estimated 100, 130 cases of monkeypox, which represents about 2% of the nation's cases. According to a spokesperson with the Maryland Department of Health, while the vaccine supply from the federal government remains limited, the state is hoping for additional supply in the fall.